I don't care if you don't know the whole Quran. It's okay. If you know two ayat, know them in depth. I don't care if you don't know all of the Bukhari. It's fine. If you know two ayat, two, two hadith, you know one dua, know it in depth. Know it well. Spend time on one thing. You know, really internalize it and then move on. Then move on to something else. It's all become about quantity and not quality. You know? Can you imagine if the ocean that looks so beautiful, by the way, if the ocean wasn't as deep as it is, it was just six inches deep, it would still look like it does. From a distance, you'd say, oh wow. But there's no depth. That's what we've become in our Islam. No depth. And no appreciation for depth. Those of you who listen to my khutbahs, how many ayat do I quote in a khutbah? Usually how many ayat, you know? Young guys come and ask me, uh, Salah, I'm giving khutbah for the first time. Can you give me a bunch of ayat? <laughs> and they write like a four-page thesis that they're going to, today's khutbah is going to be about taqwa. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, and he says, and he says, and oh, what else did he say? Where did it go? Okay, miss Salat. When you're quoting one ayah, one hadith, one ayah, one hadith, one ayah, one hadith, one story, one ayah, one hadith, you didn't stop at one ayah. أَفَلَا يَتَدَبَّرُونَ الْقُرْآنَ Why don't they think deeply about the Qur'an? لِيَدَّبَّرُوا آيَاتِهِ So they, they can think deeply about the ayat. This is thinking deeply or just moving along? I mean, when you see a beautiful mountain, do you just say, oh, that's nice? Do you do that? Or do you stand there and go, whoa? When you see an incredible painting, do you just stand there stunned by it or you just go, hmm? We don't even do that with things Allah created in this world. We're stunned. Nobody goes to the beach for one second. Oh, such a beautiful sun. Oh well. Next thing, mountain. Where's the mountain? Let's look at the mountain. Let's get this out of the way. You know? When, you are, when you're experiencing something beautiful, you want to stop. You want to taste it. You want to take it in. You want to be able to appreciate it because this might not come again. Why don't we have that attitude towards the, the text? Because we have gulu. Just give me the quick version. Where, give me the quick version. Let me move. This book is so beautiful. The sunnah is so beautiful. The Rasul's words, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, are so beautiful. They will make you cry if you just spend time on them. 